Hello and greetings, this is the Orthodox Defense Channel. Uh, today we're going to be speaking about uh, a very popular Islamic polemic. Uh, it's how God can become incarnate and doesn't that affect mean that God changed and the Old Testament in the book of Numbers states that God cannot change. So, uh, firstly, I'd like to answer that God as God didn't change and doesn't change. Even when the invisible became invisible during the incarnation of the word. The apparent divine transformation polemic that becoming man is sometimes or always apparently implies some alteration in the divine being because the word of God became flesh. That this becoming apparently implies transformation of the divine hypostasis of the word, the second person of the Godhead. And this polemic is very theologically prosaic um, because the word of God never changed his person nor nature. He kept his divine nature unchanged. He did receive a human nature when he became man. One nature is divine, one nature is human, without mingle. Neither of these natures were changed. Adding human nature didn't change the divine nature. Change means for the original substance to morph into another. But the original substance remained 100% intact and simply gained another substance. So God didn't change. The Father, Son and Holy Spirit, the mysterious Godhead, are still God in fullness. The man Jesus Christ is human, not divine in nature. But he is one with the word of God via the incarnation. 